something I didn't talk about in my book. And I just thought about it. And it's a very important part of the business and success and and the success in being an entrepreneur. And I think I'm going to add this to the next edition of the book. And I, I will add this as a new chapter. And that's coming up with good ideas. How do you come up with good ideas, new and better ideas, or just coming up with a good idea in general, something that, you know, something that's life changing, something uh, that you come up with that, you know, just takes your life and career to a whole new level, something that makes you money. It's reoccurring. It's uh, you can build a brand around it. Just coming up with a good idea. How do you come up with a good idea? And I like to talk about the importance of having brainstorming sessions. And uh, I just like to say that there's no I can't I can't sit here and take full credit for any successful project that I've worked on. It wasn't just me. It was never just me. It was other people involved. Uh, You may not. It may just be me presenting it or I may be the one doing the interview because I was the director or I oversaw the project to completion. I may have been the one to oversee it to completion, but it was never just me solely working alone. And I want to talk about the importance of brainstorming sessions and uh, having it brainstorming sessions with your team, whether it's just you and another person or it's you and three people or four people, whatever Uh, the importance of Once you establish your team, now you and your team needs to be talking. Y'all need to be talking about shit every day relating to the business. I mean, at least the hour a day conversation needs to go towards the business, building a business. What are y'all lacking? What needs to be done? Operations, even coming up with names. That's something else. Better to come up with a name that people remember. That's easy to say, easy to spell. Once you say it the first time, people get it. And you don't got to repeat yourself. That's another thing. Coming up with dope names for a business or a product. This all happens from brainstorming with your team. And if your team is just you and one other person, cool. But like I said, y'all need to be having one hour brainstorming sessions and y'all need to be writing down these ideas when y'all are brainstorming don't just be coming up with all these good ideas and laugh it off and then you forget about the shit in 10 minutes a lot of the best ideas of that is that short-term memory is that quick idea and that's why a lot of writers and uh screenwriters they carry around notepads and a lot of times i'm just driving down the street and i come up with the best ideas i come up with song lyrics So I try to keep my uh, voice recorder on my phone. That's page one of my apps on my iPhone. So I always just hit the voice recorder. And, you know, if I come up with a good line while I'm driving, I'll record it. Brainstorming, taking down your notes and uh, always just, yeah, just being ready. Just being ready to take down your ideas. With Criminals Gone Wild, when I made that movie, I was originally planning to call it Real Street Crime. I didn't, you know, the idea, I had the idea to make the video content and what it was going to be about. But then when I told my brother about what the idea was, he came up with the name Criminals Gone Wild. And that's from brainstorming. That's because I went to him. We spoke about a general business thought idea and he enhanced it. His brain, he was able to take my thoughts to the next level. And that's what having a team is all about. Some, you know, being able to take your thoughts to a higher place. Tell me, you can't do this without on your own. I mean, anybody and, and, and you know, people that think they could do things on their own or they don't. You, you really have to establish a team of people, you know, you trust that you can talk to some people. I don't even feel comfortable working around. It's the weirdest shit. Like some people when I'm making music or I'm just doing anything, I'm on the Internet. I don't even want you to see what's on my screen. So being compatible with your team members and the people that you brainstorm with is also 
important. Some people you don't want to share your ideas with. They just don't like their vibe. Some people have this pessimistic vibe about them and you just don't like their vibe. You don't want to be around them when you're sharing your ideas. You know, they might laugh at you because some of your ideas may be be crazy. <laughs> you know, they might sound sound nuts. Sometimes you don't want to share that with everybody. So finding the right people that are compatible to brainstorm with, very important. The power of the team. The power in having a team. Like I said, that's this the value. It's 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 priceless. The value of having ten competent people that are working towards a business goal. This 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 is priceless. I mean, billions of dollars are made. Snapchat, all of these Facebook, all of these companies. This wasn't just Mark Zuckerberg or who. If it's it's usually one or two or three four five core people but it's these are these are five brains these are five minds you put that together i mean it's 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 amazing like i'm constantly looking for people and team members to work with but it's 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 not easy it's not easy finding it's not easy finding good people it's not easy find finding good soldiers good leaders and then finding them do do you all clash like that sometimes the leaders sometimes a bunch of leaders in the room clash so you know it's a you just it's got to find a good team the one man show is cool it's cool to do everything on your own the one man show but get a team build a team try to build a team that's that was the good thing about school and college just meeting people being in a social environment or even just having like a regular uh, day job if if this isn't what you do full time it's always i notice like people that have day jobs they they live an awesome life because they meet people when they're out in public i i spend a lot of time in the cave working on my computer so I, sometimes i miss a lot of social interaction because I'm at home working, editing, writing. So, yeah, just uh, get out there, meet people, work with people, brainstorm all the time. We used to use this program, iChat. Everyone had MacBooks, and we'd get on iChat, and we'd have video conferences every day. Uh, I don't know, ever since the FaceTime came out and it's on the phone, it's, it's not as... Prices we we don't value iChat like we used to because that was one of the main forms of video chat. Like if everybody everybody that was hip that had a MacBook, it was all about that iChat and we get on there and do the video chat. That was right before FaceTime really took off. Now it's like so accessible face video chatting. People don't they, you know you take it for granted because it's 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 so available. Also. Always look for new ideas. I, I might have spoke about that. These are just some points that I wrote down. Always look for new ideas. Always always think about new ways to make money. Always think about new business names, business thoughts. Just don't don't give up on the thought. Just think of, think about things. Think about ways you can make the world better. Think about ways you can enhance products that already exist. Just contribute to society. You know, come up with come up with ideas. Always look for something new. All it takes is one good idea to change your life. One. One good idea, millionaire, billionaire. You know, uh change your life. Get you on you'll be on the news. Like I made that movie and uh, next thing I know I was on Bill O'Reilly's show the next day. It's just it was just just like that. Came up with the movie, executed, came out with the trailer. Did a little marketing. Was on TV all over the news. Now, it, it, it's just as easy as that. It's just as easy as that. Coming up with a good idea, executing, putting it out, putting a team together, working together, finishing, going through with the idea. And that's how you succeed. So I hope I said something that helped you, that, you know, something that you could relate with, something that helped you. Check out my book, How to Make It in the Music Business Using Social Media Marketing to Build a Large Following. It's not just about music, the music business. It's, it's about building brands and using the internet and using your laptop 
to 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 come up with ideas to market and to be successful online using viral marketing campaigns and social media to build your brand on the internet and make money ultimately make money that's the goal that's the goal of these conversations that's why I'm doing this I'm doing this I'm talking to you so you can make money so you could say hey press said something and I learned and hopefully I made some money I'm trying to help you make money you know don't hate me for don't hate me for spreading the love or the information the knowledge of uh getting that money so yeah thanks a lot for listening make sure you subscribe I'm going to be coming with these all the time because a lot of these ideas I just come up with. Some of them I've, I've written down. I have a course that I'm working on and I have the ideas written down. But sometimes these are just thoughts that come into my mind. And all of these thoughts I'm planning to implement into my book. If I left any of the information out, I plan to put it in the book and you know put out more additions as time goes on. So there you have it. Come up with good ideas. Always come up with new ideas. Always work on new ideas. Talk to you all soon. See you soon. No, talk to you soon. Peace.